Now, we've talked about how, you know, in these days of, um, you know, investment portfolios, you see every day the stories of the tech industry because we're leaders are, are driving our investments. What would be the impact on, you know, college funds, on our retirement funds, on, you know, federal employees' uh, retirement funds? You know, these, all, all of these funds out there are heavily well, invested in what are our dominant world-leading industries. Well, just remember, 25% of the rise in the stock market in the last 20 years has come from tech. Um, there's no major retirement fund, whether it's uh, TIAA, CREF, or any of the, the companies that manage retirement funds that does not invest heavily in technology. Uh, so all know, of those members of Congress who have their, yeah, their uh, they're, thrift fund, they're, they, they are invested. They're invested <laughs> in technology. And, uh, you know, you, um, uh, you, you look at these companies and the people that founded the companies that, that were the original stockholders, they may own 7 to 10 percent of the stock. But 60 percent or so belongs to 401ks, pension plans, IRA plans, uh, annuities, or uh, assets that back up life insurance. So when you're talking about destroying industries that are probably a quarter of all the retirement funds in America, you're talking about a pretty profound change. Now, it's one thing uh, when you you got plenty of money to talk about doing that, but when you think about the people who worked a lifetime to invest this money so they can have a decent retirement, and you're going to end up destroying that value uh, because of a political dispute, it's pretty damn serious business.